driveway because I guess the rock just won't release it from uh, the ice. But we'll uh, we'll try it in this red clay and see if it's any better. It's a little bit frozen and there's some root in here, so it should give us a little trouble if it was going to. Uh, so we'll give it a try. Hopefully, and uh, if it doesn't spin around, we maybe have something interesting. Get out of the mud. See, like nothing. I didn't have to hardly hold it at all, so that's pretty good. I can try it again just to see how it feels in another holder. from spinning on its side there, that's about all. Did I jump on it? That's easy. All we did to make this actually adapt to an uh, existing auger was it's just pinned onto the hole that it normally pins into. So you just basically have to see, move the pin like it normally would and then this thing would just lift off like that. So that's basically all the difference there is from a conventional earth auger to what we've done. So I don't think it's a big engineering feat, really. This is the planetary end. They just use the planetary out of a, a truck or some heavier uh, light vehicle. It's, uh, I don't think it's a very complicated planetary to get a hold of. And this just basically is spinning freely around the inside shaft. There's the lock groove that it uh, holds into the auger with and uh, the cutters are, this is very similar to the cutter that's on the existing auger right here and I just basically designed this part to be able to make a five inch center cut so it, it could be any type of configuration the guy wants to make but this seems to be okay for what we're doing right now. So anyway that's, uh, that's it I guess.
auger blade that it came with at the rental shop. We took off our little gearbox, and uh, this only turns one direction now, so I'm scared to death of it right now. We'll see what happens. One more spot just to see. Right between our old two holes. That sort of proves that my auger is pretty good since this one doesn't drill through anything and that one just drills like nothing so we'll be talking to you later. <laughs>